The unprecedented solar storm. Predictions for 2025. Imagine a world where your phone stops working, GPS signals vanish and the lights go out, all in an instant. This isn't a scene from a sci-fi movie, it's a very real possibility scientists are warning us about for 2025. A massive solar storm, unlike anything we've seen before, could disrupt satellites, communications, and even our power grids. But how does this happen? And how prepared are we for the chaos it could unleash? Buckle up as we explore the science and stakes of solar storms, and why 2025 might be a year of unprecedented challenges. What are solar storms? To understand the danger, we first need to grasp what a solar storm is. At its core, a solar storm is a violent eruption of charged particles and magnetic energy from the sun's surface. These eruptions, called coronal mass ejections or CMEs, are like cosmic hurricanes, hurling billions of tons of plasma into space at speeds of up to a million miles per hour. But not all solar storms are created equal. Most go unnoticed, while others can have profound effects on Earth. The Sun operates on an 11-year cycle, alternating between periods of relative calm and intense activity. Scientists are now predicting that we're heading into the peak of this cycle, known as the Solar Maximum, in 2025. And this one might be the most powerful we've seen in decades. A History of Solar Storms Solar storms are not a new phenomenon. In fact, history has recorded several notable events. The most infamous is the Carrington event of 1859. Named after British astronomer Richard Carrington, this massive solar storm caused telegraph lines to catch fire, delivered electric shocks to operators, and lit up the skies with auroras visible as far south as the Caribbean. Fast forward to 1989, when a solar storm knocked out Quebec's entire power grid, plunging millions into darkness for hours. And in 2012, a storm as strong as the Carrington event narrowly missed Earth. If it had hit, the consequences could have been catastrophic. These events show us that solar storms are not theoretical. They're real and they're powerful. But what makes the predictions for 2025 so alarming? Why 2025 could be different? Scientists have been closely monitoring the sun's activity and all signs point to an exceptionally active solar maximum in 2025. As we've become more dependent on technology, satellites, GPS, internet infrastructure and power grids, the stakes have never been higher. Unlike in the 19th century, when a solar storm meant flickering telegraphs, a similar event today could paralyze modern life. Satellites that control everything from weather forecasts to global communications are particularly vulnerable. The Earth's power grids, already aging and fragile, could be overwhelmed by the surge in geomagnetic energy, causing blackouts that last for weeks or even months. How solar storms affect Earth So what actually happens when a solar storm hits Earth? When a CME reaches our planet, it interacts with Earth's magnetic field. This creates geomagnetic storms, which can have a range of effects. A satellites in orbit can be damaged or even destroyed by the intense radiation. This power grids on the ground can experience surges, potentially leading to widespread blackouts. Navigation systems like GPS become unreliable, affecting everything from airplanes to smartphone apps. It, radio communications are disrupted, impacting emergency services, military operations and even your ability to stream music. The auroras, the northern and southern lights, might be a beautiful side effect, but they're a mere preview of the chaos that could ensue. Are we prepared? This brings us to a critical question. How prepared are we for a solar storm of this magnitude? 
Governments and scientists have been working to develop early warning systems to predict solar storms and mitigate their effects. Agencies like NASA and NOAA use advanced satellites to monitor solar activity and provide alerts when a storm is imminent. However, much of our infrastructure is not designed to withstand the extreme conditions a severe storm could bring. Power companies are exploring ways to harden the grid and engineers are working on more resilient satellite technology. But the truth is, if a storm as powerful as the Carrington event hits, we may still be caught off guard. The importance of awareness. Awareness is one of our best defenses. By understanding the science behind solar storms and their potential impact, we can take proactive steps to minimize risk. Individuals can invest in emergency preparedness kits, businesses can develop contingency plans, and governments can prioritize infrastructure upgrades. It's also crucial to recognize the global nature of this threat. A major solar storm wouldn't just affect one country. It could disrupt life on a global scale, requiring unprecedented international cooperation to recover. So, as we approach 2025, the sun's growing activity reminds us of the delicate balance we live in. The same star that gives us life also holds the power to disrupt it in unimaginable ways. The question isn't just whether we'll face a solar storm, it's how prepared we'll be when it happens. If this topic has sparked your curiosity, don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more insights into the wonders and dangers of our universe. What do you think? Are we ready for the next solar storm? Let us know in the comments below. And as always, stay curious and stay prepared.